what's going on guys Clickwood here back again bringing you guys something new on the channel and this is Call of Duty Black Ops 3 the beta yes we're over on the PlayStation 4 we have the Black Ops 3 beta this is kind of early into when I was first playing it guys the class that you're gonna be watching me play with is my third class I'm using an LMG called the BRM and I think it's probably one of my best guns that I've done with so far. I mean, I, I'm not the best Call of Duty player or anything like that. I've been playing since Call of Duty 4. So, I mean, I have some experience. I'm decent at shooting, but I'm not the best by any means. But this is a pretty good game for me. I have a, a pretty beast game. So I hope you guys will enjoy this one. If you do, please be sure to hit the like button. And, of course, subscribe to this channel if you are new. So, again, guys... What you're watching here is some Team Deathmatch. Uh, I know, obviously, Team Deathmatch, not exactly the most competitive game mode or anything like that. And I know what you're thinking, mostly noobs play TDM, which is usually true. But what I will say is that we're still in the beta, so pretty much a lot of people are playing TDM. Like, the first thing that most people are playing is Team Deathmatch to get their shot down, to kind of get an idea of where the map is and, and different things like that. So, uh, to me, I'm not really feeling too bad about this. I, I feel like I still did pretty well, even considering that it is TDM. So, let's talk a little bit about the game so far. Uh, first of all, I'm using the LMG, and the reason that I decided to use an LMG is because in Black Ops 2, I actually usually did pretty well with the LMGs, and I know people are probably thinking, what a noob. Yeah, I wasn't a competitive player by any means. I pretty much only played pubs. I played a little bit of league play, but not really a whole lot. I was okay, but not really anything special, so... You know, I, I enjoy using the LMGs, though, for some reason. I don't know. I, I just enjoy the fact that I don't have to sit and reload with them. I think that's one of my favorite things about it. So, um, anyway, I, yeah, that, that's kind of been my thing is using the LMGs and, and really trying to do work with them. And I think the, the big thing about the LMGs is that you can almost hold down an entire area with them because you don't have to sit and reload between every kill. And that's a big advantage. Now, I mean, obviously the LMGs shoot slower. They don't do quite as much damage as some of the other weapons do. But you can see, I'm still killing people relatively quickly. And we're going to get the triple here. I thought we got the quad, but somebody else got that fourth guy, I think, right before the missile hit him. So we just missed out on the quad kill with the Hellfire missile, but that's still okay. We're, we're okay with the fact that we only got three with our Hellstorm. That's, that's totally fine because we're inching closer and closer to getting to the Talon. Which is absolutely beastly, by the way. If you guys haven't had a chance to use that thing, that thing does some serious work. It's definitely a fun kill streak to use. It's the highest kill streak that I've unlocked so far, so I haven't had an opportunity to use some of the higher end stuff. And I know, um, you know, I think that you have to be like a, a level 15 or higher to get anything higher. I think than that. I think the RAPS is a 15, but. Check out this thing that we have in the bottom right-hand corner. I call this thing the lightning gun. Now, I, I think it's called uh, the Tempest is the uh, is the specialist that we're using. And, guys, if you don't know what the specialists are, I, I would compare them fairly close to the Destiny Supers. Uh, they're they're pretty good, but they're, I guess I wouldn't say they're as dominant as the Destiny Supers. For the most part, with the Destiny Supers, you pretty much guarantee yourself at least one kill any time that you have a Super in Destiny. But in this, I would say it's not that easy. And, th and there, we're going to miss out on our kill. That would have been an easy kill if I didn't get killed from behind there. But that's actually the only death that I'm going to take in this entire game. So yeah, needless to say, we do some serious work in this round, man, with uh, with the LMG. And like I said, we only die once. So I didn't really know what this whole kill streak was when I was using it in this game. That this is actually the first time that I got it, I think. Um, so I, I just didn't really understand what I needed to do with the Talon. So I don't end up actually utilizing it in the beginning. I'm still using my gun here. I'm doing okay with it, so I'm, I'm totally fine with that. But I didn't really realize that this thing doesn't really shoot that much unless you're controlling it yourself. So I was talking to Ryan915, who was in the game with me, and our friend Daffodil Killer, and they told me I definitely need to go into this thing and user control it. So that's what we're going to do here, rounding out the rest of this game, putting in work here, getting a double kill, and then moving in here to get the triple three piece and then the four as well so man this thing just doing some serious work we wrap around here and we probably could have gotten more kills but the time ran out we got to 75 kills just a dominant game by all of us in this one daffodil killer goes 12 and 4 ryan 
dominates at the top of the leaderboard. And then your boy going 18 and 1 this round. So feeling pretty good about how I'm playing so far. I'm really enjoying the Black Ops 3 beta, guys. I hope that you guys are as well. If you guys don't have access to it and you need access to it, check out Twitter because a ton of people are giving away tons of beta codes. So I hope to see you guys on here in the coming days. Thanks again, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more Black Ops 3, leave a comment below and like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.